Hi everyone, this is the second question on the STAR released exam for 2018. And what they want you to do for this one is to use your greatest common factor and factor out what you can factor out. You could also work, uh, distribute back and get the answer. Let me show you the real way to do it. So basically, I'm going to take my expression and what you're doing is determining what can you divide. What is your highest common factor that will divide both of these? And that's going to be um, negative 7. All right. But in, um, does this have an X in it? Yeah, this has an X. Okay, so since you have an X, you have to pick your lowest one so you can divide this out. So when you divide, and I'm just going to bring this out and do this, because you're dividing by negative 7x. And the reason you want to divide by negative is, especially you see the answer choices here, all of these are positive. So you want this two negatives to make a positive. So 28 divided by 7 is 4. x squared divided by x is just x. Then a positive divided by a negative is negative, and x, these two cancel, that equals 1. So you're just going to get 35 divided by 7 is 5. So your final answer would be answer G. Alright, I made another problem for you to do, and it's this one right here. So what you should do is pause the video, see if you can do it, and then we're going to work it out. <coughs> so basically, you're going to ask yourself what divides, what's your highest common factor, or greatest common factor that divides both of these, and it's 7. Now we want to go ahead and make our first term positive, so let's just divide by negative 7. Now also look at your x's. Um, the highest common factor that divides both x cubed and x squared is x squared. But instead of losing your divisor, just pull it out here and put your parentheses. So instead of losing the divisor, you're just pulling it out. Now two negatives make a positive. 35 divided by 7 is 5 x cubed divided by x squared is just x. Now here you have two negatives. So that's a negative divided by a negative is positive. And both of these cancel out. 7 divided by 7 is 1. x squared divided by x squared is 1. So you're going to get plus 1. And like I said at the beginning of the video, if you want, you could always check your answers or check their, their answers and just make sure you get the original answer by distributing. Okay, that's all. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.